Hello viewers, so today uh, we are going to see some uh, topics related with the C-Shop. So how to get the current uh, page URL, uh, so that is what all about we are going to do today. So let me start from uh, creating the string object. Okay, instead of uh, writing in a string, I just want to show you in the page, so I am going to use with the temp data so here uh, in a normal uh, non techy word a uh, full URL so how to get the full URL by using a HTTP context dot a request dot your dot absolute URA so this absolute uh, URA are uh, going to give us the complete URL so next level I just want to find only the path so uh, I don't want my host name so by using absolute path you will achieve this and then I want to find uh, only the host name it means my domain name host name uh, so how to get that okay so uh, so uh, this is the three uh, type of uh, way you can get a full URL or only a path or only the host name. So let me uh, go and add uh, this in my view to check whether uh, how, how we are getting those steps. Oops, uh, mistake. Just okay. Full path. name okay let's go and run the page by using that so I'll be back sorry host name it's not changed I guess yeah so my application is uh, building so I guess I just uh, not opened my application for uh, two days so it's uh, just checking my all my reference files yep we got all uh, types but I uh, but it is very clumsy let's uh, keep the breakpoint okay just refresh the page again yes so this is my uh, full URL HTTP home slash index and only my path and only my host name so that is what all about here I hope uh, it's very uh, stuff uh, that uh, you can find by using a uh, HTTP context under the request URL you have the different varieties so hope you guys enjoying my video thanks for watching the video guys please subscribe uh, to get more updates like this